Sargainis critic is still at the site of a gruesome accident that has left a seven-year-old girl dead. She lies just under that truck there. The upper half of her body is there. The lower half of her body is under the truck. Completely sliced. Whoa. Even the partners trying to get footage. <laughs> so there's a truck here that's come, a high hap truck, um, that they're making arrangements to have to heist um, the truck that is on the child, the body of the child, as a matter of fact, that child is dead and has been so for some time now. So preparations are being made to have this truck lifted to get the body of a child out from under there. What they got to do first is heist it. What they got to do is heist it and see if they got to know where they load capacity. But I'm going to stand at the back. Father, behind the white line, please. It's a very tense situation here. Moreover, the environment, a very tense environment. Uh, for those of you who have just tuned in, the Guyanese critic is coming to you from the East Bank of the Emirates. It's actually also the greater, uh, greater Georgetown. And it's just as you enter into Georgetown, it's the community of Agricola, right? Where um, somehow a seven year old who was crossing with her aunt. Um, a truck ran into them. The aunt was flung to the ground. She passed out and the child lays dead. Her upper body is pinned under the truck right there. And okay. you notice me? Oh, I, yeah. So, and the lower part of the body, feet, the two feet lay and they're intact. So it's obviously it's just over, um, just about her waist area. The seven-year-old child was cut in half at about her waist area. Her lower body, her feet, is under the truck. And I would, I could tell you, that kind of footage you do not need to access up close. Um, it is a very gruesome sight. You should be satisfied with my explanation. You know, I'm seeing it. I haven't gone close, but. You know, a lesson need to be learned from this. Um, people have died here before. That's not something you want to see. Up close, this can be haunting.
So, preparations are being made to have this truck lifted. You got mechanics at the bottom of the truck. These are big men. You would believe them man want to touch. Watch, watch, the big man got the camera in the policeman's face. You would believe they want to touch the body by it. We live on a whole different level of ignorance here. So preparations are being made to have this truck lifted. Sad situation. The mother was here earlier and she has been blacking out. Yeah, yeah, my brother. Oh, but you see, you're saying the police need to move the people. This is a tense, tense area. You don't just run up and do what you like here. This is a tense area. This is agricola. This is very, very tense. So mechanics are under the truck and it seems that they're maybe releasing the brakes for the truck. And preparations are being made to heist the truck off of the child's body. And you got the people with the cameras and you would ex you would think that you could you could there from a fair vantage point and do it. They're not satisfied with that. They want to get a photo up close and personal. Hello. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. This is a hold up for at least the next half an hour. It's come to a dead stop from coming down to Georgetown and very slow going up. Yeah, yeah. Echoes coming down from Echoes to Georgetown is dead stop at this point in time. Echoes coming down is a dead stop. It's a dead stop. Do not come down to these bank at this point in time, at least for the next half an hour. Save me, brother. So for the road users, tell your people, tell your people, do not come down at this point in time. The traffic has come to a dead stop here to facilitate the, the lifting of this truck. Yeah, yeah. So because of the mood here and because of the community, it's a little tense situation here. Um, again, for those of you who have just tuned in, the Guyanese critic is coming to you from East Bank Demerara. My, whoa. Whoa. And attempts are being made here to lift a truck off of a child who was crushed. Her lower, or two feet, um, held together by her waist, lies under the truck. 
and separated from her upper body and her body seven year old child lies under that truck i could tell you that is not a sight that you want to see um you could do with basically what i'm telling you very sad situation here for the road users the the westbound lane to georgetown the westbound lane to georgetown has been closed for a little while to facilitate i think it's both sides of traffic has been um, grind to halt to facilitate the lifting of this truck to get this child's body out from under this truck right very sad situation here so if you don't have no rail use do not come down from the east bank it's a great color this is happening and this is going to be happening here for the next couple of minutes do not come down from the east bank or attempt to go up the east bank pass a great killer for now maybe for the next half an hour the track the tra traffic has grown to halt and when it was going it's going very slow the thing is this is um, peak time um, you know a lot of people are he hustling to head home over the west coast and so on so there's a huge build up of traffic here at this point in time So we, I think these guys are from shore base. Even the foreigners come and they are, wow. They can't believe what they're seeing. Wow. Nobody's paying attention to clear. Fire. Wow. Whoa. All, everybody's just interested in getting a photograph. We could learn a lot from this. A lot can be learned from this. Yeah, my brother. Let me get a car back Hey, Daddy! 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 Hey, Daddy!
seems that it's more an exciting situation for these people than a sad one. People just talking all kind of weird stuff.